Hello, I'm Tim Hendricks of DMS International and First Strike Meters. Today I want to show you how easy it is to use our drag and drop software upgrade on our new FS1 SE meter. Drag and drop is simply moving a file from one window to another on your computer. So you click it, hold down the clicker and drag it over to the other window and it's there. Our meter works pretty much the same way. We're going to plug it in a USB port and uh, it'll be recognized as um, removable media pretty much like a USB stick would be. Okay, we've got our meter plugged in and to put it in the drag and drop mode we hold down the zero key and press the power button. And the window pops up get this situated a little better so we can see what's going on here this is actually the meter it says removable disk E you may have a different uh, identification letter on your computer now I'm going to open the FS1 SE software folder and our latest version of software is 1.57 we're going to drag that over to the window, drop it there, and it's now loading on the meter. And as soon as you see that file in the window, you can close this window and this window. The meter has the software on it. It's actually upgraded now. But I always like to do a reset on the meter just to make sure that it's a clean upgrade. And to do that, right now your meter's on and you want to turn it off. You turn it on and before the boot completes, you press 990 and that will reset your meter. And you'll know it's reset because resetting the meter erases the longitude and the latitude. And it'll also erase your user database. Anything that you may have keyed in or, or uh, copied from the default database uh, will be gone. And that, that uh, user database will be empty the default database will be fine it'll all be there yet the other thing you may be wondering is how do you know what version of software is on your meter and the way you know that is kind of the same way it, it happens during the boot process so you start with the meter off turn the meter on and before the boot completes you press the option key and doing that will show a four digit version on your meter face in this case 0157 so it's all pretty simple drag and drop reset the meter you can double check the version can't get much easier than that thanks for listening and thanks to you folks that bought our meters